Welcome to Review Racer YouTube channel. The Ryzen 7 5800X is a top choice for gaming, offering enough performance to rival most modern GPUs. If you're a gaming enthusiast, you know how important it is to have a powerful GPU to complement a high-performance CPU. With its impressive specs and performance, the best GPU for the Ryzen 7 5800X needs to be the best GPU to maximize its potential. 1. NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4080 Super The RTX 4080 Super may be overkill for many gamers and costs as much as some full-fledged systems, but its performance doesn't lie. If you have a 4K monitor and want smooth frame rates with ray tracing enabled, especially with DLSS, it's a great place to start. The RTX 4080 Super is slotted between the existing RTX 4070 Ti and RTX 4090, giving gamers a better value GPU than the existing RTX 4080. Unfortunately, this means it's quite a bit more expensive than a card that's not even at the top of NVIDIA's stack. 2. Asus ROG Strix GeForce RTX 4070 Ti Super OC Edition. The Ryzen 7 5800X is a powerful CPU, and it needs a GPU to match its performance. That's why we recommend the RTX 4070 Ti Super as the best GPU for this processor. We previously recommended the RTX 4070 Ti at the top of our list, but the RTX 4070 Ti Super is out now at the same MSRP, making it a direct replacement. This GPU offers the usual features of the 40 series cards, such as DLSS and ray tracing. It also offers a clear improvement over the 4070 Ti, which we tested in our RTX 4070 Ti Super Review. This top-of-the-line GPU is a perfect fit for the Ryzen 7 5800X and above, and will support future builds if you decide to move beyond Zen 3. 3. Gigabyte RTX 4080 Super the best GPU to go with the Ryzen 7580X is the RTX 4080 Super. Coming from the Super upgrade in the ADA series, this one adds a bit more value to the 80 model. The architecture is a really good choice, though, as NVIDIA GPUs offer features and performance that even AMD can't match. Thanks to frame generation, excellent rendering, and ray tracing performance, and DLSS 3 with its high frame rates. The 4080 Super is a strong contender for the top spot on our list. It's a strong contender even at 4K with high FPS across the board. 4. NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4070. The RTX 4070 offers good overall performance thanks to its Ada Lovelace architecture and solid 12 gigabytes of memory. It also supports ray tracing with 46 accelerators and DLSS, which keeps performance high even in more complex games. Unless you're a streamer or have a hole in your pocket, there's not much reason to spend $1,000 plus on a GPU. For many new PC builders or those looking to upgrade, the RTX 4070 is a reasonable price point at $500 to $600. 5. NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070 The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070 can be perfectly combined with the Ryzen 7 5800X. It offers the perfect balance of performance and cost, making it popular among gamers and content creators alike. Equipped with the Ampere architecture and 8GB of GDDR6 memory, the RTX 3070 handles demanding tasks and provides smooth gaming experiences at high resolutions. 6th Gigabyte Radeon RX 7600 XT Gaming OC If you want a more affordable GPU than the 5800X, the RX 7600 XT is a good choice for the job. The more affordable RDNA 3 cards are a more modern choice with improved performance over the previous generation. 
It definitely solidifies AMD's GPU as a great value choice, as NVIDIA has a hard time competing at this level. For this offering, the RX 7600XT offers 16 gigabytes of GDDR6 memory, clocked at 18 gigabits per second with a 128-bit bus for 288 gigabytes per second of bandwidth. With 2,048 Steam processors, 128 TMUs, 64 ROPs, 42 CUs, and 32 RT cores, it will launch at $329 and have a 190-watt power package. 7. XFX Speedster Merc 3, 1, 9. AMD Radeon RX 6800XT The Radeon RX 6800XT is a great CPU for gaming, and it pairs well with the 6800XT. 1440p Gaming is smooth. If you're looking for productivity, work, or content creation, this matchup is a good fit. Thanks to AMD's excellent multi-threading technology, you won't be losing anything with this GPU. The RX 6800XT is a great GPU for gamers looking for a high-performance option to pair with the Ryzen 75800X processor. This AMD GPU is based on the RDNA 2 architecture, and its specs include 4,608 stream processors, a base clock speed of 1,825 MHz, and a boost clock speed of 2,250 MHz. 8. AMD Radeon RX 7900 XT If you're looking for the best raw performance under $1,000, AMD's Radeon RX 7900 XT is your best bet. This card packs a solid 20 gigabytes of GDDR6 memory. This RDNA 3-based GPU clocks at a base of 2,000 MHz and a boost of 2,394 MHz. It also has a fairly wide 320-bit memory bus, giving it 800 gigabytes per second of memory bandwidth. All of these numbers mean that this card is a solid performer in games that don't feature ray tracing or have ray tracing settings fairly low, and it's one of AMD's most competitive cards in years. 9. AMD Radeon RX 7800XT The RX 7800XT is the best AMD GPU for the Ryzen 75800X, and like the 4070Ti Super, it should be solid for future builds. However, this GPU also uses DisplayPort 2.1 as opposed to the 1.4A of the 4070Ti Super. In our RX 7800 XT review, we saw it perform well in games and real-world tests. This top-of-the-line AMD GPU leverages the RDNA 3 architecture and offers impressive specs, including 3,840 stream processors, a 2.1 GHz base clock speed, 2.4 GHz boost clock speed, 16 GB of GDDR6 memory, and 624 gigabytes per second of memory bandwidth. The RX 7800XT is aimed at 1440p and 4K gaming and has a ton of features that make for a very capable work and play system. 10. NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti the RTX 4060 Ti looks more compromised than it appears on the spec sheet, with 8 gigabytes of memory and a slow 128-bit memory bus. Despite that, NVIDIA squeezes every ounce of performance out of this sub-$400 card, allowing you to get playable frame rates of 60-plus frames per second at 1440p or 1080p. It also still has an advantage over similarly priced AMD cards when it comes to ray tracing. With ray tracing enabled, it holds its own against the more expensive RX 7700 XT. There is a 16 gigabyte version of the 4060 Ti, but it doesn't make much sense for gamers. Like, share, subscribe to Revere Racer channel.